Good afternoon. Our first item of business today is time for reflection, and our time for reflection leader is the Reverend Richard Rowe, Royal Navy Chaplain to HMS Prince of Wales. Presiding officer, members of the Scottish Parliament, thank you for the privilege and opportunity of sharing with you this afternoon. We are in the Christian season of Advent. Culturally, it would appear that we move straight from Halloween to Christmas with a brief pause for Remembrance Sunday. But in doing so, we miss something profound and distinctly human, having to wait, being prepared to put one's own needs and desires second to another's. Advent is saying that there is a better thing a better one coming, and you'd better get ready. Make it easy for this wonderful event to happen. Prepare the way, which means it's going to take time. There are resonances of this in our everyday lives. I'm a Royal Naval Chaplain. That means I engage with Royal Naval Service personnel of whatever rate or rank they are precious to me, and they all have equal right of access to whatever I can offer, whatever their faith system or none. And I go where they go and participate where I can. That sometimes means waiting, waiting with the rest of a ship's company for the next evolution in an exercise, waiting for the return of a ship or a submarine waiting. Of course, in the normal circumstances of life, we wait for our significant others whilst they shop on a Saturday. We wait for friends to arrive for a long-anticipated meal. We wait for our favorite team to score or be, to be promoted, uh, perhaps a longer wait for some than for others. We wait for the start of a business session here or the other place or any firm you care to mention. Waiting is something we don't have a lot of control over. How we wait, the attitude we hold as we wait, we do have control over. There are many things in life we cannot either control or change. Waiting is just one of them. But what makes the difference is how we react to those things, how we behave when we cannot have or do what we want, when we want it. Because it is often in the waiting, in the margins, before the presiding officer arrives, or the exercise starts, or the meal is served, or the kickoff happens, that we engage with the people around us, where they get to know us, and we them. Where it is less about them -uns and us -uns, but about the shared experiences and the banter that arises, where barriers are breached, where we build relationships, where we prepare the way. At Advent, we prepare our hearts to receive afresh God made flesh in Jesus, the one who dwelt amongst us, as John's Gospel says, full of grace and truth. So as we wait with friends and acquaintances, our team and their team, may we use words of grace and truth, of respect and of loving kindness, that his way may be prepared and that we may be fully human under God. God bless you all. 